Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's a beautiful Tuesday morning here in uh, Boston, Mass. Uh, I'm out and about. Um, I think I'm going to have about six or seven miles this morning of uh, walking uh, before my showtime. Um, I am. I, I got it in about seven miles yesterday. Um, the idea for me is always just to keep moving. Um, hey, um, I'm preparing for the Boston Marathon. But even beyond that, I'm just preparing for my destiny. Um, what I, I, at the moment, I'm listening to a book called The Discipline of a Godly Man. And um, I, I realize for a large portion of my life, there was not that discipline um, that I needed. And so um, it's interesting to get into a different space and realizing the things that you need to do. Um, people ask me often, like, man, how's your training for the marathon going? Uh, and it's going well. Uh, uh, the, the simple answer is yes, it's going well. Um, I decided this year to do 12 marathons. And um, so the truth of the matter is I'm in a constant state of training. So when people ask that question, it's like, it's no different from any other time. I'm always running. I'm always training. Um, and the truth of the matter is, um, I'm always training. I want to do an ultra marathon. Uh, specifically, I want to do the Leadville 100. And um, so there's, you've got to be, to me, I, the feeling is that you always have to be training to be able to get there. Um, I'm right here by the airport, um, which doesn't, but it's whatever. But um, once again, the idea is to be constantly training. Um, the idea for me also is to do uh, 3,000 miles a year, uh, running, walking, trekking, hiking, whatever it is. Um, I think that's a good balance of distance for me where I'm not overdoing it, yet at the same time, I'm keeping myself uh, in prime shape for whatever I decide I want to do. Um, a lot of this experience has been amazing. It's the best way I can explain it because it, it keeps me motivated. It keeps me um, ready for whatever comes in life. Um, I, I stay in a, in a constant state of readiness. And that's an amazing feeling to me, at least. Anyway, be blessed today and every day. Uh, I'll see you later. Peace.